And with every state in the union reporting high community transmission of coronavirus, this big number catching our eye. More than one million new COVID-19 cases reported nationwide in just the last week. All right, Dr. Ashton, all the words, uh, all the stories seem to be about boosters. When That's are we going right. to need them? Do they work? So we're getting something about Pfizer specifically, and it looks like there's a benefit. Uh, yes, this is data coming out of Israel just published in the New England Journal of Medicine all about boosters. So let's take a look at what they found. They looked at over 1.1 million people 60 years of age and older compared the group that got a booster um, compared to the group that did not get a booster and they found the rates of infection 11 times lower in the booster group versus the non booster group rates of severe illness. That's really what we care about 19 times lower in the booster group versus mm. the non booster. Wow. Group. And, and what are some of the caveats to well, all when of you this? See, when you dive down on the methodology of their study, Amy, what they did, and this is important, is first of all, they looked at this data only 12 days after the booster dose. And remember, their booster dose was given five months following their second dose. Here, if we do it, it's going to be probably six months. Also, we have to remember their study results may not apply to younger people because their population was 60 years of age and older. And again, long-term follow-up is unknown at this point. So we don't know what the durability of this immune protection is one month later, two months later, six months later based on this Israeli study. Mm. All right, Dr. Jen, thank you very yeah. much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.